Jacksonville is forming a new city council committee to address race relations and broken promises to the black community. During a special meeting, council members heard from the sheriff, the state attorney, and the mayor. News 4 Jacks reporter Jim Pickett is live at City Hall now to show us how this could be a step forward. Jim. Well, you know, all of the protests that we've had, even the statues coming down, could mean some changes here in Jacksonville. You got to think of those promises made in consolidation 52 years ago. Well, now, as a result of all of this, they're starting to listen. The protests in Jacksonville aren't only about police tactics and body cam video. It's about promises not being kept in Jacksonville when it comes to city services for all neighborhoods. Today, while in the northwest portion of the city, I asked people like Dorothy Davis what she would like to see happen. I think with a few changes, um, especially as far as race relations. During a special Williams council meeting today, it was announced the Committee for Social Justice will be a clearinghouse of sorts to go through legislation expected to be filed about bringing about changes and equality for all honor the unfulfilled promises of consolidation, at the same time making certain that we have a responsive a police force and city services to all of our residents in Jacksonville. Those unfulfilled promises include lack of sewer service and other infrastructure neglect, like bad streets and no sidewalks in the core city of Jacksonville. You know, these next few months, they aren't gonna be easy. Um, you know, we, we want a, a kumbaya moment, um, but we're gonna have to peel off all the the, the dirty and the filth and the things that's been going off all these years in order to get to the root and, uh, you know, and start afresh. But this time, talk isn't cheap. In fact, council is now talking about something they've been avoiding for years, a tax increase to keep the promises. We may need to raise taxes. Yes, I said raise taxes to get done what we need to get done. And that is a gas tax increase. Now, it hasn't been set in motion yet. The first meeting on that is going to be next Tuesday as they begin preliminary discussions on raising that gas tax by a penny, and it could be used to fund those projects in Northwest Jacksonville. We're live from City Hall, Jim Pickett, Channel 4, The Local Station.